All right, guys, welcome. We're at the Morristown Airport. It's, I think, September, September 16th, and they're having a little flying event here, and we're taking this opportunity to show off the plane. So show off uh, 52 Echo, as we affectionately call it. It's our 59 model Cessna 172 that the kids had a, a heavy hand in restoring, and uh, one of them actually flew it up here today. He's scheduled for his check ride next month. Uh, he is in line to get his pilot's license before graduating high school. And uh, we're going to find some kids and see if we can make pilots out of them today. Uh, full disclaimer, I'm not a flight instructor. Well, we're gonna get her hooked on air, airplanes here. All right, How you, are you doing, man? You ready? You gotta, you gotta hold on to the yoke now, because you're gonna fly this airplane. To push the plane to nose over to go forward, you push the yoke forward. So go ahead and push the yoke forward. There you go. And to pull the plane up or make it go higher, you pull it back. So pull it back. There you go. You guys are doing good. Now you gotta be able to to read some of this stuff on the instrument panel. There, it tells you cool stuff like how high you are and and what radio frequency you're on. All right, I guess they're done flying. <laughs> the little guys are paying attention, they're learning, they, they've never seen this stuff before, and that, that's how you get introduced to aviation. Unfortunately, it's, uh, it's about uh, heavily addictive, and uh, they'll want to fly uh, all the time, and they won't want to play with uh, toys or get into, get into mischievous activities if they get into aviation. Those pedals that your feet are called rudder, they control the yaw of the aircraft, which is how you steer on the ground and how what you... Is that that's for a radio. What's this, Dad? Jesse, what does that button by the compass do? So that, that uh, is a knob that you use to adjust the heading to oh, make okay. this more accurate. 